mercy. We are standing here today because we're deeply disturbed improvements in this very housing complex. Too many organizations are getting money from the federal government and the state, and they are not taking care of the people that they're supposed to. Senator Warnock said that uh, we were trying to hurt the name of Dr. King. Well, first of all, Dr. King has nothing to do with what's going on behind us right now. And I think it's wrong to have leaders to not retake responsibility to do what's right. You know, my campaign is about doing what's right for the people of Georgia. What's happening to that money? Because the very people it's supposed to help are not being to do. There is accountability. And I stand here before you all today and I'm asking. Now, since he's brought my name in and also he brought one of the greatest black leaders ever name in because he don't want to take responsibility of what's happening with this economy with the border, with all the inflation. Well, when you're a leader, be a leader. Why aren't you doing what you're supposed to do with that money? I want to know. Talk to me. As I rise, there's a warrior who is fighting tirelessly for the people of Georgia, who has the heart and the strength and the faith. Reverend Warner is one that's not being honest. And right now, he knows that it's time for him to step up and be a leader. At the debate, he didn't answer a question. Leaders take the responsibility to be a leader, and I'm the leader. Ebenezer Baptist Church owned this property, and his name is in the filing. It's Senator Warnock. His name, Reverend Warnock, 